What's going on YouTube? Team StarCraft here bringing you actually a non-StarCraft video. Um, I wanted to do a little video discussion over this other game I play called The Hunter Primal. So just hanging out here today by the lake. As you can see, beautiful, beautiful sunny day to be hanging out by the waterside. Um, so for those of you who don't know, I'll do a little basic introduction. Uh, Hunter Primal is a hunting game kind of with a little bit of survival elements. It takes place on this island called Primal Eden and pretty much you are stranded on the island with, you know, dinosaurs. You have to run around, open crates, find loot, gather items, you know, and then you can hunt the dinosaurs once you get better gear and camo and things of that nature. Until then, it's pretty easy to get killed. Um, you gotta do a lot of crouching, sneaking around and stuff to make sure you don't die and then when you get better camo you can kind of walk around and the dinosaurs won't notice you or hunt you as much. So this game is freaking phenomenal. Uh, the early access phase of it started I wanna say towards the end of December and it went all the way up until March. Initially there was only three dinosaurs. There was the Triceratops, the T-Rex, and Utah Raptors. And it was pretty phenomenal. When the developers made this game, they set out to they set out to meet a couple goals. Like they wanted to eventually have like an experience system, and also they were going to add. So they're going to add two more species of dinosaurs. So then, as the game progressed, they did add one species. They added the Velociraptor, which I felt was kind of like a little little slap on the wrist. Like they pretty much reskinned the Utah Raptor, made it smaller, and not even challenging to hunt at all. You could whack it with this thing right here called the machete and just one-shot him. Um, and on top of their AI is pretty glitchy. But, you know, it was okay. It was still an early access phase. They were still updating the game. They added a couple more weapons, added, like, experience system, um, the shop so you could buy stuff and get money for your trophies or whatever dinosaurs you hunt. Um, and then they released the game, they added the last dinosaur, the Quetz Quetel, or however you say that, and that Quetz was a, a complete disaster. It was like, overpowered, it was flying around, they'd be like two or three in the sky at once, they'd lift you up, drop you, kill you almost instantly, and then they like nerfed it. Um, and now it's just this annoying bird that flies around that, you know, I personally don't even really want to hunt. It's not fun at all to hunt. I'm going to hide out in this tree, this seems like a perfect spot to hide out and discuss discuss the state of this game this beautiful game called the hunter primal so anyways as far as the developers seem to be concerned they have met their goals and you know that was what they posted and said they were going to do initially but the problem is they made a pretty freaking awesome game okay like this game is phenomenal and you know it's released and they don't really update it anymore and it's a shame and this is actually why I'm kind of making this video discussion to just kind of talk about it so in their eyes you know they met this goal but in like the eyes of the users or everybody who plays this game and everybody who comments on the steam forums like this game is awesome but you know it still feels unfinished you know like how can you make a game as a developer, meet your goals and feel finished about it when the whole community doesn't feel like it's a finished game. And what the problem is is that you made a really, really freaking great game and you need to add more to it, okay? Because, for example, you know, like if I open up my inventory right now. Ooh, well, um, that usually doesn't happen. Usually, when I open up my inventory, I can't see any of my items. Uh, it's this bug that has been going on along since I started the game. Um, but this is the first time it's actually not done that. I wonder if it has something to do with me having my video recording software on. Because <laughs> I haven't opened a crate. After I see a crate, then I can see the items in my item display. And, you know, there's still all these little bugs and the dinosaur hitboxes need work and it's... You know, inconsistent. You can shoot a dinosaur, two different dinosaurs in the exact same spot, and one will be a one-shot kill, and the other one will take up, like, 30 shots before you kill it, you know? And not only that, but it feels like this game is, like, their red-headed stepchild. Like, the developers, they don't post on the Steam forums. 
They'll reply on their Facebook page, but all their replies have been like, Bro, oh, we're not working on the Hunter Primal. We'll have little updates in the future, but they won't be as frequent as we've been updating. And, you know, the general feeling is that they don't care and this game is not a priority to them. And I don't see why it's not. You know, this game is, like, brilliant. They hit the tip of the iceberg with this game. It's like dinosaurs are like the new zombies, okay? Jurassic World came out this year. The dinosaur hype is in. Uh, Jurassic World, by the way, was number one box office hit. And I think I think of all time is what they said. Because there are little Facebook posts like, Dinosaurs rule the world again. And, you know, the thing with this game versus their, you know, quote-unquote baby, The Hunter, which is the game they focus on, is that, you know, The Hunter's good, but The Hunter just is focused on just, you know, hunting. It's a hunting simulator. With this game, they've added a little bit of survival to hunting and freaking dinosaurs. So if I like a hunting, if I like hunting, realistic hunting, as realistic as dinosaur hunting can get, this is the game. If I like the survival feel, you know, running around, trying to get loot and items, hiding from dinosaurs, trying not to die, you know, I like this game. If I like, you know, uh, just dinosaurs, I like this game. This game is freaking phenomenal and so much fun to play and has so much potential and you know I just this is hard to understand why as a developer you don't want to improve this game and work on it you know I mean even if your only goal is to make money you can make so much money with this game if you have updates and make the community pay for them they will pay because the community wants more content you know I'm not going to get into too much detail about updates um, and things of that nature but there is so much more you can do with this game I mean yeah, like I said, it still feels unfinished. Like, for example, there's five dinosaurs, and four of them try to kill you, and there's one herbivore. All there are is triceratops. You know, from that aspect, it's not realistic. And they could do little things, just have, like, dead dinosaur bones lying around the map in little spots, make it look like there's more species. Or, you know, they could just, you know, add more species to the ecosystem and make it a more realistic... They have the chance here to monopolize on this game and make it like the number one game for anyone who likes dinosaurs, survival, or you know even just hunting. And you know they really need to capitalize on it. And that's how the whole community feels. Like if you go on the Steam forums, um, and they haven't been on the Steam forums, you know, or else they would know. Like everybody wants to see this game grow everybody wants more content the developers you guys have a community that is excited about this game that wants to play this game that wants to throw their money at you and show this game to their friends but you know when someone gets on the forum and there's not an update for this game or even just a post from the developer saying hey what's up for like the last you know two and a half months you know it gives the feeling that this is a dead game and you know maybe it is a dying game but that's why I'm making this video, because I want to get it out there. I want to see some change in this game. Um, I guess we'll go walk around a little bit, blow off some steam. Um, anyways, but yeah, see, like, I mean, it's not hard. Even if you're not going to update the game, you could post, like, once a week. Take three minutes of your time to just post on the Steam forums or post Facebook status about the game. Just show that you still like the game that you made, you know? Even if you did it just once a month, you know, just like first of every month, just a little update status. Hey, hunters, how's it going? Or hey, dinosaur hunters, how's it going? You know, because, you know, they have two different fan pools. You know, but there's a couple people who play the hunter and the hunter primal. But then there's people who just play the hunter primal and really don't even like the hunter. or It just doesn't appeal to them. You know, I'm one of those people. Um, and this game, look, look, it's just beautiful. It is a beautiful freaking game. You know, like, why not finish? Even if, like, even if money is your only motive, and who doesn't want money? <laughs> finish the game. If not, just open up and let the community mod it, or sell it out to, like, a developer who would actually like to finish this game, you know, because, you know, I know this is probably just a side project for them, but, oh my gosh, so much potential for this game. Um, anyways... I think that pretty much sums up how I feel, and I know how a lot of you guys feel. Everyone wants to see updates, you know. I'm not going to go too much into describing updates, but just little things, you know. You could add a couple more dinosaur species, because that's 
what everybody freaking wants, but there's just so many little concepts they could add to this game, like, you know, they've got a lot of plants, and there's the little poison bushes um, that everyone sees, but you could add different kinds of plants to the environment, a uh, different level to the complexity of hunting. You know, right now it's just, you know, grab a gun and shoot. Um, there is, like, a Triceratops college where you could bait a Triceratops, too. You could add, like, more things, like, kind of like baits and lures and little traps, you know, to try to ambush a T-Rex out in the field and actually, you know, hunt it safely. Um, baby dinosaurs, you already reskin the Utah Raptor to make it a little Velociraptor. You might as well just add baby dinosaurs to all the species, you know. It would be pretty phenomenal to just walk around and see, like, a Triceratops with little, little baby Triceratops, you know. Maybe tamper with the hitboxes or how much ammo you need to dish out to kill the little dinosaurs, you know. Find a little baby Rex, which would be like a giant raptor. You know, just little things like that would be so freaking cool. Um, oh, you know, just weapons, basic spear at the little settlement camps that you can use as like the machete instead, or you know, like aim it and throw it into a freaking dinosaur. Like the the options are limitless. I have like a whole list of ideas I'd like to see in this game, and the whole community has so much feedback, and they are ready and willing, and they would love. To freaking help finish this game because it just doesn't fin feel finished you know so if any of the developers are out there I mean please do something about it if not like if you guys want to focus on the hunter that's right but like get a second team or at least one member of your staff who will actually talk to the community on the forums and bring the feedback back and no let us know that you're there okay we want to know this game is not dead okay um, I think that's it for this video. Let me know if you guys liked it. If you want, I can post another video because I've got a long list of things that I think would be beautiful if implemented into the Hunter Primal. Or if you guys want a video of actual gameplay and actual dinosaur hunting because I really didn't do anything. Just uh, looked at the sites. Let me know. I'd be happy to maybe branch out and post a couple of the Hunter Primal videos on here. But that's pretty much it. I think I'm just going to get to the top of this hill. Uh, try to show you guys the lay of the land here uh, and what Primal Eden is. There's a noble camp up ahead. Um, I think there's some raptors close by actually, so we probably load up our guns. Um, <laughs> Alright, if you guys are watching, um, that's pretty much it for me as far as discussing the state of this game. I'm just going to go to this camp, get some gear. Uh, maybe kill these raptors if they try to kill me. Let's see. Oh, actually. I may have uh, irritated somebody. We need to crouch. And make sure we do not die. But see, you gotta just be careful. This is what this whole game is about. You know, you gotta hunt the dinosaurs and not let them hunt you. I think they're probably up on this hill. Could run to the noble camp, I might be safe. I don't see them, but I hear them. I don't see them, but I hear them. Yeah, they're probably just over this little corner. Oh, there it is. There is the little raptor. For the record, I haven't played this game in probably a month or two. Uh, but I do check the forums frequently because I'm waiting for them to update this. Um, so, I don't know if I trust my hunting skills right at this point. And I knew I hear multiple ones. I just don't want to get ambushed and have them kill me. Oh, but I'm getting very tempted to shoot that raptor. Oh, he's moving down the open. We could probably get him over here. Ooh, I think there's a T-Rex in the distance too. Yep, 
Yep, we're close by a T-Rex. Um, there's Triceratops behind me. Anyways, I don't want this video to be too long because it was just for the discussion. So if you guys want to see me shoot some bloody dinosaurs, uh, leave a note. Let me know in the comment section. But yeah, hope you guys uh, feel the same way about this game that I do. Um, and if you do, please share this video with people or, you know, just keep bombarding the Facebook. Cause that seems to be the only page where the developers actually see anything the community wants to say and responds. Because, you know, they don't look on the Steam forums at all. They do not look at it. Okay, hopefully we can make this game better, guys. Alright, see you guys next time.